Mike, thank you. And now to an update on the nearly 14,000 acre fire in Fremont County. We know there are new evacuations in place and even more people have left their homes. Let's get right out to KRDO News Channel 13's Emily Allen, who's been tracking the fire all week. Emily, when is the big concern today? John and Dana, this is a new map of the fire. The incident commander tells me that today they believe that the fire is going to make its way south and burn this area of federal land. But in this area, there is a predominantly easterly wind, and they do believe that that is going to also cause this fire to continue to creep to the east. So again, it'll move south, but then also continue working its way to the east. This little section down here is what burned yesterday. Now, here is some video of that fire that was burning as it burned yesterday. Firefighters say it wasn't a good day because the fire just blew up around 12 o'clock. But the incident commander is staying positive. He says this rugged terrain, in a way, is helping firefighters. In my opinion, it's going to take a lot of rain to knock this out. Here is a breakdown of the stats for this fire. Right now, it has burned 14,000 acres. There are more than 400 people that are working on this fire. Right now, 140 homes are evacuated, and it is 0% contained. Coming up in the next half hour, I asked the Fremont County Sheriff if he expects any more mandatory evacuations to come down anytime soon. I'll have his response coming up. In Salida, Emily Allen, Carrio, News Channel 13.